वेलकम बैक गाइस दिस इज क्वेश्चन 15 एंड हियर वी हैव टू सिंपलीफाई द सर्किट इन फिगर 5.57 ओके सो दिस इज फिगर 5.57 एंड वी हैव टू सिंपलीफाई इट एज मच एज पॉसिबल ओके सो द सिंपलीफाइड टर्म विल शुड बी एज मच एज पॉसिबल एंड वी हैव टू वेरीफाई दैट द सिंपलीफाइड सर्किट इज इक्वलेंट टू द ओरिजिनल by showing that the truth tables are identical okay so we have to draw the truth tables of them as well so let me first write the expression for them okay so let me first write the expression for my circuit here so here i can see that the output here is a b okay while here to this gate three inputs are given a b c and the output of it is a b c and x here will be the summation of them so the output of it here will be a b plus a b c okay so this is the expression which i had here and this is equal to x okay we can also convert it to the uh, standard form by what by multiplying this term with the c plus c complement so x will be equal to a b c plus c complement and here i will have a b c and the output of it will be x equal to a b c plus ABC complement plus ABC. Okay, we can see that these two terms are identical. Okay, this one and this and this one. And according to the rules, we can see that the ABC plus ABC is equal to ABC. So therefore, the output of X will be ABC plus ABC complement okay so this is the expression of the circuit which is given so this is what this is the expression of the circuit which is given in figure 5.57 and this is in standard form so let me uh, write the truth table for it so in order to write the truth table i have three inputs and these are a b c and the output of it is x okay so these uh this is basically a truth table and let me write different combinations so 0 0 0 0 0 1 okay 0 1 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 and the last one is 1 1 1 okay so this is what this is the truth table for it and from this expression i can very easily see that the output will be only one for the binary values which i can calculate here and those binary values are 1 1 1 and 1 1 0 okay so for them the output will be what the output will be one so these are the last two values and all the other values will be what zero so this is the truth table for the circuit given here okay uh, after it what i can do here i can also simplify this one this uh, expression by using two methods one is the conventional method and this conventional method is based on the boolean algebra rules and the second method which i can use is the Kornhoff map so here i am going to use the first method you can also apply the Kornhoff math method as well but here i am going to use the first method and here i can see that this is the expression and from this expression the in two expressions this a b let me use this uh, blue color for uh, yellow color for it this a b is common in between them and i can see that taking it common what i will get i will get here c plus c complement and according to the rules of the booleans algebra what i have x plus x complement is always equal to one and therefore the output of it will be what the output of it will be x equal to a b multiplied by 1 okay so the output of it will be x equal to 
a b okay so this is what this is the final expression or the simplified term and we can very easily see that the uh, expression here is just showing me that the two inputs when given it will give me the output which is the product of the two and this can be implemented by using the if i have two inputs and these are a b and these are given to this and circuit and here i will get x equal to a b this is the output which i wanted to find out okay so this is the simplified version now i have to see that how come these two are identical and uh, drawing the uh, truth table for this expression i have here a b and the output here is x so 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 this is the verification uh, so in order to verify it i will get that this is 0 0 0 1 and this is the truth table of this and gate okay so this is inside this and get that i can get this one similarly here in this uh, circuit i can very easily see that the only the i will get the outputs equal to 1 only when the values of a b are both are 1s and in other scenarios when any one of them is 0 okay i can see that in the first two both are zeros in the second uh, in the third and fourth only a is 0 and in fifth six b is 0 so in any of that condition i can see that it is not seeing that whether the, uh, the input c is 1 or 0 but it is giving me the output equal to 0 but in the scenario when both of them are equal to 1 it the output of it giving me 1 and this is honestly and very easily i can see that this is a functionality of an and gate okay so therefore it is verified that the output which is given here is the answer so that is the verification stage in which i have got that the output here x equal to a b is the output which i had to find out and the truth tables here and here these two are identical so that's it for today and i have in which i have solved question 15 and i will see you with some more interesting questions in our upcoming video till then take care of yourself